Hey guys, it's Chelsea, and you're watching episode 3 of the PGP Summer Vlog Series, part 2. So I thought today we could talk a little bit about what some of your to-do lists will look like for this summer, um, what reports we'll need you to do. So there's lots of reports. Of course, we'll need you to update the Facebook page. And most importantly is the alumni report. Oh, and of course, the internship report. But first, you'll have to send out the survey. And of course, the video blogs. That's the most important piece that we want. Did you have your first one done maybe by June 20th? And we've also talked to a few companies about field trips. So if you could work on those, we'll want to schedule one for June and mark probably one for July. So you just have to talk to the person there and coordinate with them. And then if you could interview some of the students on campus to see what they have to decide, that would be really good. A pen and a pad of paper will be your best friend in this internship. When I first started at PGP, they gave me all the things that they'll have me be doing over the course of the summer. Some of them I have yet to start, some of them I'm in progress on, and some are already completed. But the only way I can keep track of all of those is by writing them down, because otherwise they'll just float away and they'll never get done. Okay, so let's go over some tasks I have for you this summer. Oh, excuse me, can I get my notebook first? Oh, sure. Okay, I'm ready for anything. Great. right next door to mine and she keeps blasting music. You can get her to turn it down? Okay, I'll handle this. When it comes to interacting with other employees, if you have a problem with someone, try to communicate with them face to face. Be upfront but respectful and don't go to a supervisor unless you really, really have to. Excuse me, your music's really loud and distracting to me. Could you turn it down? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know it was that loud. I'll make sure that I keep it down. <laughs> I'm the best intern in this place. All the other interns are totally jealous of me. Well, I'm glad we have this meeting today. Overall, we're pleased with your work. There are a few things I want to talk to you about. You have been tardy a couple times. We really need you to be on time. And sometimes you're easily distracted. I notice you're getting phone calls and, you know, trying to listen to music rather than working on the reports. We do expect a bit more from you, but I'm glad we could have this talk now, halfway through the summer. That way maybe you can turn things around for the second half. Make sure that you're getting constant feedback from your employer on how you're doing so you don't think that you're the best when you have areas of improvement. It's possible that they will come and review with you on occasion, but if they don't automatically do that, ask them how you're doing. Let's get down to the basics here. There are a couple huge no-nos when you're at a job. The following are examples of what will make a bad impression on your employers. I'm sorry, this is very important, or I would stop. Making eye contact with you. You can tell I'm listening. Mm -hmm. Sorry, are you talking to me? So that completes part one and part two of our series on how to be the best intern. I will be bringing you a new topic next time I see you, but farewell for now.